Hey guys, how you doing? Hopefully you're doing okay. I'm going to give you an overview of this case, this article here. There is a link in the description. If you do appreciate the coverage of this topic, please do like, comment, subscribe, share the video as you see fit. It's in regards to the murder of this man here that you see in front of you, Danny Humble. He was killed last year in Cramlington, England, and he was beaten to death. He was beaten to death by five youths one of which this one here on the left alistair dixon has been found guilty of murder four others these three and one more were found guilty of manslaughter over the death of danny humble essentially he was walking home um walking home after a night out with his partner and um some lads these lads five lads had a little joke with him had a little joke. They said that he looked like uh, Ant from Ant and Deck. If you're from England, you know who Ant and Deck are. If you're not from England, uh, they're TV presenters, extremely famous. They um, they host all kinds of shows. Uh, very, very popular. Very, very well known. And uh, they joked that he looked like one of the two TV stars and then seemingly, according to this article here, and again, of course, I don't know the full details, uh, but seemingly uh, the victim, Danny Humble, tried to punch one of the group who was aged 16 at the time. And then following that, he was beaten by the group of five youths that were aged between 16 and 17 years of age at the time. Uh this one on the left, Alastair Dixon, has been charged with murder because he is believed to have stamped on the head of the victim, Danny Humble, which was the death blow that is uh, what killed him, seemingly. So that one gets murder. The other four, these three plus one more, whose name has been withheld for legal reasons, um, face manslaughter. They, they've been found guilty of manslaughter the judge has said that when sentencing takes place in september that all of them can expect lengthy custodial sentences so as i say one has been found guilty of murder four others have been found guilty of manslaughter of this gentleman here danny humble sentencing will take place in september and the judge has said that it will involve lengthy custodial services for all of them um, so that's really as much of the article that i choose to go over uh, it is a tragic situation full condolences to the family of danny humble and uh, it's a real shame because it's not only the death of danny humble 35 years of age uh, but it's also these guys these five of them have thrown their own lives away they will get lengthy custodial services, according to what the judge says. Having said that, in England, as far as I'm aware, it's very likely that uh, they will also be granted parole. So, for example, they may be given, and I'm kind of guessing here, by the way, I'm kind of guessing, but they could get receive anywhere between 10 and 25 years in jail, but there's the likelihood that they'll get parole, and that could be roughly... Um, about half of the term so i wouldn't be surprised if the judge's statements that they'll each receive lengthy custodial terms i wouldn't be surprised if uh, that's a bit of exaggeration i wouldn't be surprised if the sentencing isn't as strong as many of us would like um, perhaps i'll do an update on that when sentencing does occur in september but for now i'm going to wrap things up uh, so here's the tragic situation of Danny Humble, beaten to death by five youths, aged 16 and 17 at the time, one of which stamped on his head, killing him. Going to wrap things up here, guys. Please do like, comment, subscribe, share the video as you see fit, and take care.